Bangladesh is a developing country of 150 million people with a 55,000 square miles area. It gained independence on December 16, 1971 through sacrifice of millions. The country has made impressive gains since its independence, reduction in population growth rate, child and maternal mortality, increase in life expectancy and enrollment of children at primary levels, growth of garment sector, empowerment of women, etc. are some examples. However, challenges exist in terms of governance, political patronage and unequal distribution of resources. In 2002, Manushir Junno started as a project of care with support of DFID and later became an independent organization as Manushir Junno Foundation. In the last 10 years, MJF has been able to establish itself as the premier national organization providing funding and capacity building support to civil society organizations working on human rights and governance all over Bangladesh. Presently, it is funded by UK Aid and the Royal Norwegian Embassy. Till date, MJF has partnered with over 200 organizations and presently, the number is 106. The governing board of MJF is the policy-making body and provides leadership and guidance. It is not that simple to find the right partners. Fortunately, we've been able to develop the office capacity. We now have over 60 personnel working in Manusha Chunda Foundation who are doing a remarkable job. entitlement বা তাদের যে প্রয়োজনীয় বেসিক সার্ভিসেস এটা ডিমান্ড যেন করতে পারে এটাই হলো আমাদের মূল কাজ আর অপর দিকে যেটা আমরা বলি সাপ্লাই সাইড সাপ্লাই সাইড যেন উদ্যোগী হয়ে এই জনগণের এই দাবির প্রতি রেসপন্সিভ হতে পারে আমরা বেসরকারি সংগঠনদেরকে আর্থিক এবং দক্ষতা বৃদ্ধি সহায়তা দিয়ে থাকি টার্গেটিং দ্য মোস্ট ভালনারেবল এন্ড মার্জিনালাইজড পপুলেশন MJF provides support to partner organizations in four thematic areas. Rights of marginalized people in Chittagong Hill Tracts, combating violence against women, protection of working children and vulnerable workers, ensuring responsiveness of public institutions. The marginalized target population include persons with disability, sex workers, transgender, untouchables, ethnic minority, landless, and those living in hard-to-reach areas. The main objective of this program is to build capacity of poor and marginalized people for creating demand to ensure better public services and their dignity. So far, 12,000 families received around 10,300 acres of cash land the monetary value of which is about 3,100 million taka, approximately 43,600 marginalized, discriminated people got services from public and private hospitals. Special quota is allocated in government services and public education institutes for the untouchable Dalit people. The allocation for them is doubled in this annual budget. People living in the CHT are deprived of basic services. MJF supported partners program resulted in 11,000 indigenous students studying in their mother tongue in 300 remote areas, 20,000 extreme poor people receiving food support during lean seasons through 40 rice banks. The main objective of combating violence against women program is to change existing attitude of society towards women and reduce violence. Manushar Junno Foundation is a very important part of it. But the people who are living in Gajipur are living in the world. It's a very important part of it. It's a very important part of it. It's a very important part of it. This program has successfully stopped 27,500 early marriages and 4,000 dowries. 60,000 women received social safety net benefits. MJF and its partners played active role in drafting and enactment of Domestic Violence Act. 
protection of working children and vulnerable workers, is focused on withdrawing children from hazardous occupation and ensure safe working environment for workers. Partner organizations also work with informal sector workers such as chatal, domestic workers and migrant workers. Approximately 3.5 million workforce of RMG sector have benefited by advocacy of increase of minimum wages by 80%. MJF has worked with the government to reform the present labor law which will contribute towards more benefits and better working conditions. উৎসব ছুটি কিভাবে পাইতে হয় এগুলো আমরা শ্রমিকরা জানতাম না মানুষের জন্য ফাউন্ডেশন কাজ করার ফলে আমি শিখতে পারছি এবং আমার কমিটির সবাই জানতে পারছে ইন দ্য ওয়ার্ক প্লেস অ্যাপ্রক্সিমেটলি 55000 children are working in safe environment and near about 15000 children are withdrawn from hazardous labor to safe occupation mjf worked intensively for child labor elimination policy 2010 and child pornography regulation law 2012 ensuring responsiveness of public institutions program targets to ensure better services for the poor potibandi bhata bgd bga patingor bhata egulai amader janagon peye thaken MJF partner organizations ensured that 42,800 households receive different allowances through monitoring. 1.6 million people have better access to services like health, education and agriculture extension services. 30,000 vulnerable people benefited through functional village courts, shalish and government legal aid fund. and 70 million taka was recovered one of the great achievements of mjf has been to lead the demand for an enactment of right to information act manusher jonno foundation ke obhinandan janacchi e karone je totthya adhikar ayin bastobayone tara eta purodhar bhumika rekhechilen totthya adhikar ayin ti byabohar kore moulik adhikar somporke jante pare manusher jonno tader je gujogon ke bodhe apnar bolen partner organizations tader madhye যেভাবে একজন তৃণমূল পর্যায়ে পৌঁছে গেছেন এবং আমি এমনও জানি কিছু কিছু কমিউনিটিস আছে যাদের কথা কখনো কেউ চিন্তা করেনি তাদেরকে নিয়ে কিন্তু দেখেছি যে মানুষের জন্য কাজ করেছে যে সমাজটি বিনির্মাণের জন্য তিরিশ লাখ শহীদ একাত্তরে তাদের প্রাণ দিয়েছেন এবং আমরা আশান্বিত যে আমরা ঠিক পথে এগোচ্ছি